Welcome to the GMS News. I'm Jada. And I'm AJ. Welcome to the GMS News show for the week of February 13th, 2023. If any students interested in foot, so they can participate at high school every Sunday from 2 to 4. If you need to leave school, make sure you have a note from home to give to the front office. Any 6th, 7th, and 8th grader that's interesting in playing club baseball every Tuesday and Thursday at the Greenwood High School at 7 to 9 p.m. at the high school barn. There will be a skate party at Franklin Skate Club on February 28th from 6 to 8 p.m. So dust off the old skates and get ready to roll. Greenwood Lassie League registration is open. Visit GreenwoodLassieLeague.org to register. Have a good week, GMS. Now, let's get to Top Trending. Welcome to Top Trending, where we share the top and weird stories of the week. I'm Griffin. And I'm Cameron. Let's get started. A man was hospitalized after getting sick from eating a meal from Taco Bell that allegedly contained rat poison, a spokesperson from Arifo County Sheriff's Office in California confirmed to today.com. Deputies found no criminal activity at the scene, but learned that the argument was over a soda machine not working. The customer asked for food for a food replacement instead of soda and left with it. For our next story, on January 9th, the National Weather Service warned people in California of another wave of powerful storms. For weeks, part of the state had been battered by served wind, heavy rain, and snow. At least 17 people have died, hundreds and thousands. Thousands have lost electricity. The extreme weather in California is a, is the result of atmospheric rivers along the bands of moisture that stretch over the Pacific Ocean. These have brought one storm after another, just days apart. Hopefully, the extreme weather stops soon. Have a good week, GMS. Welcome to GMS Sports. Let's look, let's look at this week's home events. I'm great. Let's get started. 7th and 8th grade girls basketball on Tuesday versus John Wood starting at 5.30 p.m. Wrestling versus Santa Grove Central on Thursday starting at 5.30 p.m. That's all for GMS Sports. How have you found out about FTC? I first learned about FTC when I was in high school and I joined First Robotics with my friends. It's kind of a club we did at school. Then when I became an adult and a teacher, I decided I wanted to help out and be a mentor. Last year I was in robotics in FLL and I thought it would be really fun to join robotics again in FTC. My former math teacher told me that he thought I would enjoy doing it, so I decided to give it a try. When I was on the FLO team in sixth grade, decided to continue with robotics and I found out about FTC. It would be the next step of my robotics career. I learned about FTC because I saw my school had a team. It looked interesting to me, so I joined it. It's been a lot of fun. My sister did FTC and she was like my age, so through my childhood, I found it like interesting and I got like interested in FTC. Hello GMS, welcome to this week's weather forecast. This is the week of February 13th to February 17th. So on Monday, you expect a high of 39 degrees. It's going to be partly cloudy, so I want to go outside, just get to school and go home, play video games or something. 25% precipitation and 12 miles per hour wind. On Tuesday, more precipitation. It's going to rain. I mean... You could probably just wear like a hoodie and then make it better. But again, I wouldn't really go outside this week. It's kind of cold. But maybe Wednesday if you had like a raincoat. Because it'll be 65 in February. So it'll be warm. So if you have a raincoat, you could probably play outside for a long time. It will be rainy though. But just in case uh, you don't want to get struck, I would not go outside on Thursday. You might like die. Because there's a high of 48, but uh, lightning. So uh, we don't want to any injuries. And then Friday, high of 45, a low of 25. It's just a normally cloudy day. You could probably go outside with a sweatshirt. That's all for weather this week. Welcome to GMS Roll Call. Once again, we are asking students to share their favorite joke. How do celebrities 
keep so cool. They have many fans. Why did it take so long for the pirates to learn the alphabet? Because they were stuck at sea. What do you call a sleeping bull? A bulldozer. Why did the bike fall over? Because it was too tired. What do you call a pig with a that does karate? A pork chop. Why do we tell actors to break a leg? Because they get casted in a play. How do you fix a broken pumpkin with a pumpkin patch? Where do you learn to make ice cream? Sunday school. <laughs> why did the cookie why did the cookie go to the doctor? Because he was feeling crummy. What do you call an alligator an alligator that's a, a detective? And an investigator. I wrote a song on a tortilla. It's actually more of a rap. What do you call a can opener that can't open? A can't opener. What did the mother buffalo say to her son when he went to school? Bye, son.